Hello everyone, welcome back to DIY Geek YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to discuss and test about um, this two pack. Well, actually, I'm just gonna review one, but it came in a two pack from Amazon. Uh, it is a outdoor lightning control photo cell. It's rated for 120 to 277 volt. Um, this is a um, a photo cell that looks like this there's also another photo cell that looks more familiar kind of like a rectangular um, and I'm gonna put that picture uh, somewhere on the screen here right now so you can see so anyway this is uh, the second well not the second I'm replacing the rectangular because I bought that about a year ago and I have a video installing that and surprisingly, after only about a year, it kind of um, malfunctioned. It's not really working right anymore. I see spark um, inside uh, and, and it's not producing correct power. So I'm going to try this particular version like this. And uh, in the meantime, <coughs> excuse me, uh, in the meantime, I'm also um, taking the opportunity to learn what's going on inside because I'm wondering um whether it actually does variable voltage as it's connecting like as the light goes in and out does it do variable voltage or does it have a uh, a quick switch like a relay inside so this is what i found out so far um well let me explain how i do my tests so uh on this side right here it goes to a wall plug so it powers the uh the black cable here is supposed to be the uh, line or the source of the voltage and uh, the white cable here is neutral and um, uh, the red cable uh, is supposed to be the load so this is going to uh, do the switching so when there is light there is no power here or supposed to be very li very little power um, I found it to be 8 to 9 volt of AC power here when there is light and when there is no light and this photo cell is supposed to um, transfer the power um, I hear a click inside here and immediately the red, the red cable here um, have the same voltage as what we have here on the black cable so the line uh, power gets transferred to the red as, as soon as there is no light passing through this photo cell resistor. All right, so I'm gonna demonstrate that and hopefully you guys can also hear the clicking noise and um, of the relay and I think that's how it works. Um, if I'm missing something here, just by uh, describing this wrongly, please uh, comment in the, uh, uh, leave your comment at the bottom of this video. All right, so let's, uh, let's, let's, let's start the demonstration. Okay, so we are going to switch the multimeter on to AC volt and uh, currently um, the voltage is already supplying the voltage here to the line, to the black cable which is line and as you can see the voltage here is uh, uh, on, on the red cable is only registering at about 8.8 zero or 8.12 etc so 8 volt only almost nothing on this side here um, I'm going to cover the photo cell sensor using my finger and uh, you should be able to see that it jumped okay see uh, it goes all the way to 108 it ramps up pretty quickly I mean within two seconds it goes up that high and the reaction is yeah it's about, only about two seconds and I'm going to expose it to the light again uncover it I think it's gonna take uh, a few seconds took about uh, I would say six or seven seconds or maybe ten seconds for it to go back down to no power let's do that again so that's it almost immediately and then I'm gonna count 1 1000, 2 1000, 3 1000, 4 1000, 5 1000, 6 1000, 7 1000. <clears> so, excuse me, uh, it takes about 7 seconds for it to 
turn off when it detects light. Um, I'm going to see if you can detect the clicking noise. I'm going to see if I can uh, put this close to the microphone real quick. Okay, I'm going to uh, do the triggering of the light and putting this as close to the phone. I'm using a phone to record, so I'm putting it as close as possible to the uh, microphone so that you can hear the clicking noise. Yeah, hang on a second. Not sure what's going on. It's not doing it. There. Okay. I'm going to let it go. In about seven seconds, it's going to click back. Yeah, I don't know if you heard that. Let's, let's do that one more time. See if you can hear. There's got to be a relay in here. Here. There you go. All right, so I hope you guys heard that. Um, there's got to be a relay in there, some something that is uh, clicking back and forth, but it's, in, it's, a, it's a switch. It's not a gradual electronic ramp up or ramp down, which I was worried about that was ruining my whatever device that you have connected to this. Um, yeah, so this is a uh, 120 to 277 volt, um, pretty extensive range very flexible 277 is pretty common for commercial properties parking lot uses this is why um, i need this particular device for for parking lot light contactor um, so i'm gonna do the installation um, video also for this particular uh, device on a separate video and i um, uh, hope you find this video useful this is just about the um, um, what's what's inside and and how it works etc and how to hook it up um so if you find this video useful please give it a thumbs up and uh, if you like the, this kind of content please consider subscribing to my channel appreciate it thank you thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel to see more do-it-yourself video like these and support my channel thank you